They're a convenient form of payment, but credit cards can also be a major debt trap if they're used in the wrong way. And there's one particularly bad habit that is costing Aussies big time. Uh, Sunrise consumer correspondent Sean White has been investigating. Morning, Sean. Yeah, morning, guys. Really convenient, but Aussies are making a range of mistakes every day. But would you believe most of us don't even know how much interest we're paying? Every day, Aussies happily swipe away. But convenience comes at a cost, and it's leaving many cardholders swimming in debt. I think it's that mentality of uh, spending a little more than we have, thinking, oh, well, I'll have it next month or I'll have it in, the, in a couple of months. And you put it off and then realise you're, you're underneath a mountain. Consumer comparison service Finder has found two-thirds of credit card holders don't know one crucial detail about their cards. A whopping 64% of Aussies have no idea what their interest rate is. They typically range between 7.49% and 25.99%, with the average being 17.04%. Taylor Blackburn is Finder's money specialist. Not knowing your interest rate can actually cost you hundreds of dollars a year, so a lot of times you have an introductory rate on a card for six months at 0%. Um, you don't really know what the interest rate is after that. Also, the interest rate can go up month on month, really with very little notice. The next trap, annual fees. A lot of times you have a, a sweetheart deal where it's, it's no annual fee for the first year or uh, reduced annual fee. You're earning points, you're earning miles. Uh, the next thing you know, the anniversary date strikes and, and bam, you get hit with a massive fee. In some cases, you can get good value. Say, with an airline card, you may spend four or $500 for an annual fee, but you're getting more than that back on flights. But the experts say you need to crunch the numbers and consider whether you're really in front. Next up, late fees. Compare the market.com.au found 18% of Aussies regularly incur them, with those fees ranging from $10 to $30. Over a year, that can quickly add up. A missed payment can also hurt your credit score. That's the number lenders use to work out how responsible you are with money and whether they want to lend to you. If you are looking for ways to stay on top of your credit card, first up, check your credit score to see how your financial status stacks up. Well, next, set reminders for repayments. And if you are really struggling... If you're carrying a debt on your card, look into a balance transfer. Um, a lot of times you can get a 0% rate for about two years, um, and that can save you hundreds of dollars on your debt. But a big warning here. Don't continue using the card you just transferred from and end up in a bigger black hole of debt. Yeah, I think uh, the balance transfer, a great solution for some people, right, Koshi, but I think mm. it can also be quite bad if you <laughs> continue yeah, if, it, if it's a spending. balance transfer, you've got to pay it off in that time. That's set your goal to do it. Mm. If not, it gets very expensive. Nothing, Good advice, Sean. Yeah, there's nothing more annoying than paying interest to the bank yes, at that rate.